Have you heard of thought stopping? When we think about our feelings and our feelings causing us angst or stress, anxiety, consequences, we have to remember that a feeling comes from a thought. The thought comes first. So if we can identify the thought, maybe it's, oh, I'm so angry because I was passed over for a promotion. And we think, oh, well, the feeling that comes from that anger, that's coming from a fear that I am inadequate, that I am not as good as someone else who got the promotion. If I stop that, I know in my heart I am good enough. If there are things I want to change about my resume or my workplace, that's fine. But if we can stop that, no, you are not inadequate. You are not less than. Stop that thought and replace it. When we catch ourselves and stop that negative thinking, replace it with positive thinking, not toxic positive thinking, positive realistic thinking, we change the outcome. We change those bad feelings that we're putting on ourselves that we don't need to have. So rather than, oh, uh, my friend never called me back or my friend never texted back, they put left it on red. Rather than being angry or upset or worried about that, we say, oh, I'm thinking that my friend no longer wants to be my friend or that we don't have as close of a friendship as we, as I thought we did. Stop that. And if you want to know, ask your friend. Too many times we make assumptions and don't follow up. And then we leave this assumption out in the world when normally our assumptions are not right. We're not considering the whole thing. So if I might say, hey, is everything okay? I haven't heard from you in a while. They could be like, oh yeah, I'm really, I've just really been busy. Or they might say something like, you know what? I kind of want to talk about something. Cool. Now we can move through it. Life is not all rose-colored lenses. It's not all roses. It's not all sunshine and rainbows. But if we just try to address it in the moment, we can save ourselves so much time, anxiety, stress, and heartache and deepen our connections with others. So practice thought stopping. Stop that thought, really analyze it, and change it for the positive. Life is tough enough without that. Make it easier on yourself. I'm Dr. Meredith Rausch, helping you connect better with yourself and each other.